Today we're trying a variety of builds that we just haven't quite done justice this week. Some may be revisiting old builds while others are brand new, fresh off the mental press. Yes, we'll be stacking polar bears, but there is so much more to see beyond just these polar bears. Check it out and I hope you enjoy. I, I really want to make sure I'm getting like the most, the most optimal build possible. And I don't think we're quite achieving it yet. So I, I think there's more room for improvement, which is not a bad thing. Don't get me wrong. Okay, good snipes. Love it. Dude, this tennis ball is on point today. Love to see it. Alright, start me with a nice level here. I mean, I'll hang on to a goldfish. Throw you in. Glug, glug, glug. Mr. Goldfish. Do this. Grab some more tennis balls. I mean, I'll actually consider a Sphinx here. I think that would be pretty solid. Maybe a Mandrill. Ooh. Those are some ugly hits we got there. <laughs> Not what you want to see. Um, let's combine here. Grab a Sphinx. We'll do the level up guy. Maybe we don't need Mandrill right now. Um, let's sell you. Run a Bigfoot. Straight up. Do we shrimp here? I think we shrimp here. Dude, we're finding a whole lot of these sphinxes out here. I'm not sure we want them though, you know? Ooh, penguin. Tempting. Very tempting. Alright, we'll just get the Sphinx next turn, refresh the toy, and then keep running it. Oh, we got the freaking capybara, dude. Lucky. Okay, go here. Refresh our magic lamp. Throw you in. We could run a griffin. <laughs> Is it worth it though? We tried it before and it did not go well. I say we don't bother with it for now. I've been told I need to run an owl. So maybe we'll try an owl here. Man, if that guy finds a toy, he's going to be a menace. I'm very glad he didn't. Ooh, big. Level you. Um, we could swap you for a starfish. That seems good. And then straight up. I think we toss the Bigfoot. Grab an owl. Toss you. Do a little double up here. Roll me once for free. Not really what I was hoping for, I'll be honest. I don't even think garlic is like good with you right now. Maybe just pigeon. I sell the pigeon, get a little extra stats here. And then our owl will generate a mouse for us. Very nice. Okay. Love it. That health doesn't do a whole lot if you don't have attack with it. Alright, sell you. Start statting you up a bit. Don't hit the duck. Rude. <laughs> I feel like that happens more often than it should. Um, we could level you. Seems pretty good. What are you? You guys are tier 3 and 4. Do we want any tier 5s right now? I'll try it. 
a cow maybe. I've also been told a cow is pretty good. Do we sell you? I think we sell you. Throw a cow in the mix. Hold on to the owl, of course. How could you not? Oh boy. That guy's gonna go crazy. Okay, we go here, we go here. Is the cow sticking around? Maybe. Honestly, get rid of the gecko. Unlucky. That's fine. What if we try this? The eagle, and then we get him some rice. Hmm, well that's kind of ugly. What if we buy sell a lemur? Give him some garlic, and then we'll just waffles you. I think this is okay. So we're going to try to give the seagull some rice, and then he'll just kind of go ham, in theory. That's the idea, at least. Ooh, level two me? Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Okay, um, I think we get rid of the cow here. We got some weird economy build cooking. I like it. Eagle. We can do a buy sell first. Yeah. I had to do it that order though, or I wouldn't have had enough money, unfortunately. Okay, still waiting on the rice and the seagull. Who would have known seagulls like rice? That's crazy. Holy giant owl. Okay. He's living my dream. <laughs> All right. Big apple me. Is a 2-4 good for 2 mana? I don't think so. I think I'd rather do something like this. Then we can hold on to the chocolate. Straight up. I don't see right. Just kidding, I found the rice. <laughs> Target acquired. We have located the rice. Okay, we're good. That was kind of close, actually. But we're cooking. Alright, tier 6 me. What do we got? So first, let's not, let's not screw up our order here. We go here, we go here. Sell you. Do we switch out the starfish? We could throw in like a behemoth here. Which is probably pretty good. Let's try it. I mean, starfish is giving basically no stats in the grand scheme of things. We go here. Um, I guess behemoth has rice now. <laughs> sure. Um, what do we have? Swan, cow, blobfish, marmoset. I don't think we really care about that. We do care about this, though. And we roll. Everybody gets buffed. Love it. There's so many options. I don't know what to do. <laughs> What's the best one? We got dragons, we got bird of paradise. Everything is... It's basically a, the saying, you know, the world is your is your oyster, but IRL. Huge. Can we get this seagull level 2, please? That'd be pretty cash money. Owl could be pretty good too. Don't get me wrong. We can buy Salgarial here. Uh, melon maybe? Melon's probably gonna do more than any of the other options will. I feel like we're scaling pretty quick. 
You know, we're, we're getting there. Bird of Paradise is definitely doing its job. Love it. Thank you very much. Um, I don't think we care about either of those foods. We go here. We roll. Not seeing anything here that I like. I do love the crow. What do we add? Okay. We can buy a cell. And then we go here. Probably. Bird of Paradise, me? Hmm, not quite. Shrimp, Sphinx, Owl, Pig. We got some decent buy cells here. I like it. Sell you for a ton of money. And now we roll. Oh, baby, we're cooking. Oh, baby. Max level me. Keep mongoose for later. I'm gonna cow. I'm gonna have a cow. As they say, sometimes. I think all of the stats go into Behemoth, and we'll let the Bird of Paradise do the rest. Um, straight up, I think we just buy you, sell you. No, maybe we roll. Yeah, let's roll. You don't need to buy anything. That way we get the 2-2 two -two guaranteed on these guys. Okay, I love it. I'm loving where we're at right now. Behemoth has almost exceeded 50-50. Always a good sign. This guy's running the worst toy ever invented. Check it out. Literally just give 1-1 one, one per turn. Okay. Oh, <laughs> no. Why do you have to go in front? I thought he would go behind him. Come on. I feel like I got cheated a little bit. And then we go Mongoose. I feel like Palm Tree is probably the play. Roll me. Ooh, yes please. Buy, sell you, of course. Then we go here. Love it. Don't even need the behemoth. You can buy, sell a platypus, just because it only costs one. And then, what do we have? Four out of seven. Next thing we buy will trigger. Let's just roll. Let's roll. Um, we play blue ringed, it'll trigger you, so I, I'd rather grab a food, if anything. Or a seagull. I'm down to go for a level 3 seagull. Seems pretty good. Behemoth has officially eclipsed 50-50. Fantastic news. <laughs> and now he's just insanely strong. Alright. Now this time our mouse didn't get mega gimped, which is a good start. Alright, now let's roll. Oh baby, we're killing it. It's happening. Get ready, y'all. Okay, we roll. I'm not liking any of these. Okay, start me with a stoat. Don't even need him. I like the the offer, but we don't need him. We go here. Um, hold on to you for later. What are you? Behemoth, starfish, owl, shrimp. We straight up don't need any of those. So let's just grab a blue ringed. And then... <laughs> what, throw in a goldfish? No, we just roll. Try to find something else good. Mongoose, we could get a level 2 air palm. Oh, baby. Wouldn't that be something? Or just throw in a puma. That would also be pretty good. If we lose here, no shot we're losing the next one. Just throwing it out there. But I don't think that's going to happen either. <laughs> Alright. I have been... I've been changed. I'm a changed man. I love the seagull rice. 
That is very strong. With the owl, too. That's a, that's a fun little combo. I like it. We're going to try out some less commonly used things. All right. Speaking of, here's the magpie. <laughs> so there's a lot of, uh, a lot of toy builds going on here. Interesting. Okay. The one squad. Um, and obviously the toy builds are very good. We have already looked into that, right? Um, but today, I think we just do this. Look for some more duplicates here. So today we're going to try experimenting around with some less used pets. You'll see what I mean. All right, starting with the level. I think Owl is probably good. Um, do we ever get rid of you? Kinda want to, but maybe we do Sphinx here. Magic lamp. Level. Maybe get a Sphinx level even, I don't know. I don't really get the, the benefit of the magpie really. Doesn't make much sense to me. Okay, level you. Capybara seems great. We do this. Get rid of you. Roll me. Full send. Lucky cat me. Then get rid of you too. Ew, don't hit here. Thank you. He actually listened. Crazy. Okay, we go here. Every time. All right, this feels like a garlic press angle. Oh, this is definitely a garlic press angle. Okay. Um, I mean, we should probably be making room for our owl. Now that I think about it. Um, let's see, get rid of you. Throw in a weasel. Ooh, another weasel. We do this. Okay, get rid of you. Ooh, stoat me. I like it. Beautiful. I'm still in my tying <laughs> setup here. I need to start moving guys back up front. Okay. And we garlic first and then we can sell. Get a little weasel cook in here. Um, crow is not bad. Hold on to you. Very interesting. Um... We're going into tier four. We can keep, we can keep them. Honestly, dude, I don't know if the owl's sticking around. We haven't found any more of them. That's generally not a good sign. But we'll see. There's another owl. Okay. I'm down to try it. Um, let's go here into here. A silver fox, huh? Is it a silver fox or a manta ray angle? That's the question. Manta ray is bigger. Maybe it's a get rid of the owl angle. <laughs> Hold on to you. Ooh, I like the stoat. We're going to be getting a ton of gold here, which will set us up well for some irregular pivots. Fantastic. What do we got here? Gariel? No thanks. <laughs> it's a weird sound. Okay. Um, let's get rid of the Cappy, I think. 
he's made himself useful. I think we uh, we appreciate it, and it's time to go. We could buy sell food dog. I think I'd rather just roll though. Maybe run a seagull. Don't think we need it. Okay. Let's see how this silver fox does. Ooh, two hits. Lovely. Ooh, off by one. You hate to see it. Alright, sell you. Obviously, we gotta get you cooking up a bit. We could behemoth. Mongoose. If we go Behemoth, we'd get rid of Manta, probably. Realistically, we should probably get rid of the Weasel. That's a pretty inconsistent amount here. Let's see how far this economy will take us. <laughs> Hold on to you. Um, maybe freeze you. What if we go like a blue ringed octopus catfish kind of build? That could be cool. I'm down to try it. Again, Behemoth should not be chilling out back. <laughs> We're just asking for draws at this point. Okay. Oh, right. We can't freeze the waffle. I'm kind of tempted to get rid of this owl here. I think I might do that. What do you have? Uh, manta ray, maybe? Bobfish for free? I'll consider it. Um, let's see. I mean, we're on lemon turn, so I don't really want to throw garlic on you. But that also requires us to find it, <laughs> and that's not, not a guarantee. Okay. Yeah, we're not finding... We, we didn't find a single pill that round. What the heck is that? Lovely. Dude, the silver fox is taken over. Ooh, ooh, don't mind if I do. Yes, I think we do this. Level you. I sell an oyster, sure. We go here. What did you have? Sauropod. Yeah, none of that's really that good. Can we get another chocolate? Or a pill. Found a chocolate. We'll take it. Okay. I like where we're at right now. There's the pill. Huge. Um, yeah. I think we're good here. I'm tempted to run, so I want to get a catfish whenever we eventually find one. As we probably will at some point. Once we do, I think we'll get rid of the Manta. Um, let's see. Hold on to you. Will you, maybe? Drop you. Let's see if we can find a catfish. We can drop you in. Give us better odds. Okay. I think I like this. Catfish? No catfish. You? Nope. <laughs> Still doesn't count. Level you, huge. Give you a lemon. There's our catfish, huge. Um, yeah, I think we're just chilling. Probably get rid of Manta Ray at some point, I just don't know when. I mean, that would be nice, but <laughs> I'm not picking any of these guys. 
Uh, maybe just get another behemoth. Call it a day. Do our double behemoth strat again. Three, three a turn. Heck yeah. All right. Get rid of you. You ain't doing nothing. Excalibur, I guess. Just because we can. Okay. Here's how it's gonna work. We get you leveled. Into another behemoth. Okay. I guess we are running behemoth after all. See how quickly we can rank up these homies. Looking good. Seven wins so far. Lovely. Ooh, can we get a level three? That would be huge. Come on. Hold on to the waffle. We could always do a waffle if we need. We'll do it. Another 3-3. Three, three. Pretty solid. This guy's running mega economy build. <laughs> I'm sorry your run had to end there. That looked like a fun one. I kind of wish... Part of me wants it to not cap <laughs> the amount of money that you can get. I get why it is, but... Just imagine how fun that would be. You get like 50 gold around or something. Um, I think we're just... They're like a durian on this guy or something. I don't know. Durian on you, maybe. Um, that's always good. Maybe mushroom you. Maybe you're, you just get rid of you. At some point. Looking pretty strong. <laughs> Looking pretty good. Then we just get 9-9 nine, nine on everybody. I don't even think the mushroom is worth it. I think I'd rather just get more waffles at this point. That's all we want. Just give me a bunch of waffles. Love it. Waffle. These can only be tier 6 actually. We couldn't get a waffle there. I mean that's a pretty strong scaler too. It's kind of insane. Not too bad, actually. <laughs> we got the catfish achievement. Look at that. And the blue ring octopus achievement. Yeah, so it's kind of one of those, you know... Actually, we probably don't have a behemoth achievement, now that I think about it. Maybe we try to get that one. But yeah, when you have this much gold, you can kind of just run whatever you want. <laughs> um, I think gecko makes sense here. We'll just have to get a toy next turn, or the following turn, maybe. Ooh, I don't like that at all. That is ugly. We go here, we roll. No toys whatsoever, that's crazy. All right, let's just hope. Please, no tennis ball. Ooh, he doesn't have a tennis ball. And he has a mouse. Oh, we got lucky there. That could have been bad. Level mate. Owl shrimp combo. Seems alright. Roll me. Another level. Okay. Oh yes, that's true, that's true. Very true. Um, we'll go witch's broom, hold the pangolin. 
I really want to get the golden beetle working. I was thinking so hard trying to figure out how to make that thing work. I don't think it, there's a way. I don't think it's going to happen. And you can trigger it, don't get me wrong, but... It doesn't mean it's good, you know? actually quite ungood. Alright, garlic press. Oh, dude, we're cooking on these shrimp out here. This is fantastic. Garlic's going to town. I love it. That is perfect. Alright, start me with a level. And then we can sell you. I think we run a seagull here. Roll me. I was hoping to find... This will refresh you. Hoping to find some rice. But that didn't work. Gecko Garlic, is that the strongest combo this weekly? Maybe. Strongest early game for sure, I would say. Um, let's see. We can buy, sell one guy. Or just get an avocado. Let's get an avocado. There aren't really a whole lot of good buy cells in there. Oh, you need attack. That's an issue. They got more health than you have attack. It's where things start to have problems. Okay, sell you. Hold on to you. I mean, starfish is pretty good, potentially. Get rid of Gecko, full send, on the buy cell. There's the rice. Love it. Yeah, we'll just do that. Get some attack cooking. Dude, this is just... <laughs> This is buy sell city out here. This is insanity. Roll me one more time. I think I'm good with this. Any pills? Anyone got any pills here? Um, Gary Ol. Tempting. Um, I don't think we need it. I'd rather get like a, a flashlight or something. Definitely need attack, but we're doing all right. Level you first. Speaking of flashlight, okay. <laughs> I'll take it. Now I gotta remember, we can't have the owl up front, or the flashlight's gonna buff the mouse. It's a cruel twist of fate. I always get the blobfish pill. Right before the owl is about to spawn a mouse. Yeah, I hate to see it. Um, we might... Do we hang on to a mouse? Probably not. Seems a little silly. What the heck are you building? Can't even tell. Weird four squad or something. Alright, sell you... Then we level you, so we refresh all of your triggers. And then we keep cooking. We sell. Do one more buy sell, and then throw in a seagull. 
I like where we're at right now. I think this is very good. It's about time to pivot though, I will say. This is where other people start scaling and then we're having issues. Starfish. Buffing the wrong guy again. Typical. <laughs> you know what I want to try? What if we just get a giant polar bear? What if we get like two tier three polar bears? 24 at 24 every turn on whoever we want. Could be pretty good. Okay, I think we do this and I think we get rid of the shrimp, to be honest. I feel like the shrimp is a little underwhelming. We go here. Start me here. Tamarin. Just for, for fun. Dude, look at all this gold he just got from the seagull. Insanity. Alright, start you up here. Ooh, hello. Uh, <laughs> we're gonna be buffing our oyster. That seems like a bad idea. Um, let's do... Who do we want to buff? I haven't even thought about that. Um, who's the best one to get really big? I mean, Behemoth, of course, but we haven't gotten there yet. Roll me. See if something shows up. A giant hamster, maybe? <laughs> maybe, maybe. Roll me one more. Or even a polar bear? What if he buffs himself? What are you, 8-8? Eight, eight? You're gonna be a 12-16. Not bad, actually. Um, <laughs> yeah, let's do it. Full send. Oh, he's running Polar Bear too. I respect it. We sell you. I can't believe our owl is still level one. Isn't that crazy? Okay, <laughs> now he's tier three, or level three, I should say. And now I guess we look for another polar bear? Is that the plan? We're just gonna get a whole bunch of them? Can't freeze you. We need to freeze our polar bears. We didn't find any polar bears. That's an issue. I haven't thought this far ahead. Um... Gold. I mean, we could keep the anglerfish, maybe. It just gives the buffs to a random frozen pet, so... I give it to the crow here, I don't know. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Which is fine. Not a huge issue. Okay, what do you have? Puma, owl... Flying Squirrel Behemoth. Behemoth could be good. I say we give it a shot. We didn't find it. That's a, an angry little sound you made there. Got to find more polar bears. Any polar bears out there? Anybody? <laughs> Anybody at all? Uh, let's try again on the behemoth. Same two rolls. Rigged, maybe. I 
Come on. Polar bear me. There he is. <laughs> We've located the polar bear. Okay. So I think we get rid of the starfish here. Because we don't want to sell the mouse until we use the chocolate. Let's be real, the starfish isn't doing anything anymore. 1620, not bad. We might just win here, I don't know. <laughs> Hopefully not. There's a lot left to be done. Come on, where are the polar bears? Where are they hiding? There he is. Found him. Okay. <laughs> it's probably over here, but we'll see. Oh, he's got a peanut, though. He's got a lot of them. Okay, good. Bring him on. Okay. So... Oh, they half buffed here, half buffed here. I was like, he, he doesn't seem that big. That would make sense. Behemoth, huge. Loving it. Another polar bear. <laughs> Another polar bear. This is fantastic. How much is this? 24, 28, 28 per turn. That's pretty good. All targeted on the one dude. And we're not winning this one too. Fantastic. How far can we take it? I don't even care if we get 10 wins. I just want to see this through. How many polar bears is too many polar bears? Is there such a thing? I'm not sure. Um, we probably should be using our seagull though. Let's not forget about him. Maybe. Don't even need him. Can't freeze. We have to keep it all going on the behemoth here. <laughs> I mean, we're, we're actually really weak, by the way. I don't think we're gonna win. Yeah, everybody's 50-50. <laughs> Casually just the biggest throw ever. Or we got a 72-72 behemoth. What do you have to say about that? That's actually kind of crazy, by the way. Can we just sit another behemoth in the tank if we find one? Hmm. Roll me. Roll me. There he is. If we draw. <laughs> I'm actually going to do it like this. Give us higher chances of drawing. Okay. What do we got? He just pops out as a 74-74. No. <laughs> Alright, well that wasn't happening. Okay, so maybe that was too many polar bears. Maybe. But you can't say that wasn't fun. A fun little twist. I'm sure you haven't seen this one in the in-games, have you? Anyway, hope you all enjoy. I'll catch you in the next one.